Minister of the Federal Capital Territory, Vice Tanya Sumwike, has expressed dissatisfaction with the slow pace of work on the Akpo Karishi and Karishi Ara Road project. Vice Sawike, while speaking to newsmen following an inspection of the project, highlighted lack of commitment as a major factor causing delays. FCT correspondent Naomi Oleribe has details. Minister of the Federal Capital Territory, Baris Tanyasom Wiki, pointed out the absence of construction equipment on site as evidence of the contractor's negligence. He said government has already provided 80% of the funds for this project, which was awarded in 2011, and yet no significant progress has been made. Even in terms of security, this alone can lead to insecurity. So I think let us do with the original uh, design and then complete it, uh, perhaps in the next six, seven uh, months. But like I've said, the contractor must show us that they have the capacity to deliver. And then we we'll make him have an uh, under, um, undertaking that funds provided, he will complete it within the duration of six, seven uh, months. Regarding the Karishi Ara Road, Barrister Wiki questioned why it was the responsibility of the Federal Capital Territory Administration to complete a road serving neighboring states. How do we do it for uh, our State? I think it is in an uh, intercity. That is a federal road, uh, a project. Cannot be MCT a project. The completion of the 13-kilometer Apo Karishi Road is expected to alleviate the traffic congestion along the AYA Nyanya Maraba Expressway. Naomi Oleribe, ADBN News.